Well, I finally found the house. Better knock at the door and wait for my unknown friend. Nobody answers the door. But it seems there is someone inside because the lights are on. Better have a look inside through the window. Excuse me! Do you see a tree at the end of the alley from up there? I can't see anything from up here. You better go see the end of the alley yourself. Ah, uh, it's so cold and terrible tonight. What a heavy rain it is. Yes, it's too cold. God bless these youngsters. We can get warm with the fire they made. How come? Don't you have electricity or oil? No, sir. After the big war, nobody cares about this isolated part. Ah, uh, so sorry to hear that. Hope your problems are over soon. Excuse me, sir. You know where the lighthouse is? Yes, dear. Everyone knows the lighthouse here. Why do you want to go there? Well, I'm looking for an address. Thank you for your help. You have a strong will. In case you need anything, just tell me. They call me Jiffy, bro. Here. Thanks, Jiffy, bro. Okay. I'd better take a look inside the house to see if anyone is there or not. Sure. I doubt if our landlord has forgotten the appointment. Nope, there is no other way. According to the lamplight, it seems there was someone there and latched the door from inside. I have to find something to open the door with. I think the rope and hook of the boat boat will come handy. I can use them to open the door of the house. Just a little problem. How do I get there? Oh, my god. Who did this? Who is this poor guy? It seems as if his eyes were staring at a certain place when dying. Well, there is no use in sitting here and thinking of horrible thoughts. I'd better look round to find an escape route. If there is something on the table, the ward will get busy with it and I can get out. No, the kitchen staff will find out about me. Better change my clothes. Better go before anyone notices. The documents are in Iran and I'm wanted here by the police. What can I do? Now that the doctor Fatimi me is in London, I should inform him about the dangers of cop. Hi, Mr. Fatimi. Sorry to take your time. Hey, what have you done to yourself? What's the matter? I got involved in the murder of an employee in the British Embassy. When I found a clue, the English police force arrested me and put me in the jail. Anyway, I escaped from there and by the cellar of the barn next to the hotel I got here. Now I'll do whatever you order. Mm -hmm. Well, I think the best you can do is to get a fake ID and go to Iran in disguise with tomorrow evening's flight. I know a friend who can help you with the passport. Good luck, Ami. Thank you, doctor. Have to see you soon. Hi, sir. Sure, here you are. I wrote it down on this paper. Sorry, but the doctor is waiting for you in the mortuary. Okay, thanks. Hi, sir. It is good that that came soon. When did it happen? Last night, Mohammed Masood stayed in his office to print an important article. He was there till midnight and then he was attacked and murdered. Who found the body? The caretaker of the printing office found the body and reported at once. What have you found? I search everywhere, but no clues, just one point. The murderer must have used a silencer, as no neighbor, passerby, or even the caretaker has heard any shooting. Well, he was used to stay late in the office to get the articles ready for the next day's printing. You know, today man is an evening daily. Did you also stay here late last night? Yes, I stayed. Did you hear any shooting? No, sir. Unfortunately, I didn't hear anything. Okay, can I have a look at Mr. Masu's office? Sure, sir. Here you are. This is the key to his room. Thanks. Detective Afshar speaking. Oh, Detective. I'm glad you picked up the phone. Who did you expect to answer at this time of night? What is it, Sabipur? Unfortunately, a murder on Ekbatan Street is reported. And again another poor drunk or a stupid tramp. No, detective. It is more serious. A famous journalist was assassinated. Who? Come on, Zabipur. Mohammad Masood, managing director of today's Man Daily. What? Masood? Oh my god. Okay, I'll be there in a moment.